There are just too many streaming services out there, right? No one could try them all, you just can't afford it. Unless, of course, you could. Hmm, and I'm gonna tell you how. I'm gonna show you a calendar that we've created that will help you on a quest to sample 39 different streaming services. Whew, that's a lot of streaming. We better get started. So, let's dive in. The streaming world these days is so much bigger than just Netflix and Hulu and those kind of standard options. Have you tried BritBox? How about Boomerang? Or the Criterion Channel? Or the Urban Movie Channel? Or you want to get really sappy? Not only is there a Hallmark Movies Now, there's also the Lifetime Movie Club. You can get your fill. So yeah, streaming services are legion. And not only is that a lot of content to try to wade through all at once, it can get really expensive. In fact, we did the math on 39 different services, and even with the cheaper plans, you could end up paying over $5,700 in a single year if you got them all. So no, that's really not much of an option. But most streaming services have a trial period for you to check it out and see if you wanna sign up on a more permanent basis. Now, what I do not recommend here is abusing that system to get everything free forever by skirting rules and jumping through loopholes. But what I do recommend is thinking strategically about which services to sign up for and when to maximize the free trial experience. And that's where the writers over at reviews.org come in. My colleagues have created a calendar, and if you go to the description below, you'll find a link to that Google calendar that they have made and which you can add to your own calendar. And that's gonna give you a schedule for which services to sign up for over the next year. Not only will the calendar remind you when to sign up for a service, It'll also remind you the day before your free trial is up, so you'll have a little warning before any charges actually go through. Of course, you don't have to cancel every service. If you sign up for the Shudder free trial right before Halloween, but you just love the glut of horror movies to be had there, then by all means, keep it around. And that's kind of the purpose of this whole calendar, to give you a chance to try them all, and then pick a few that really fit your viewing habits. That way, instead of paying nearly $6,000 a year on streaming, you could keep it to a couple hundred or less because we did sprinkle in the services that you can always get for free. Peacock, Tubi, Pluto, Crackle, Vudu, and IMDB TV. So armed with some great free options and with a calendar to guide you through the free trials for all the rest, you can really broaden your content horizons and you don't have to fork over a bunch to do it. So go forth or well, rather go to the description, click on that link, go check out that calendar. And while you're at it, check out reviews.org for more reviews and analysis of your home services like TV and streaming, internet, home security, cell phone service, and more. Of course, you know what amazing content is always free? This channel. So if you're watching this on YouTube, make sure you subscribe, ring that bell, give this video a like, and let me know in the comments what streaming services you'd be most excited to try out that you haven't yet. Thanks for watching everybody. I'll see you next time.